What's up, guys? So we have another one. Um, name that movie. So I think this was like one of those TV, like made for TV movies, and it took place most likely during the 1900s, post Civil War. Um, and it most likely took place, I want to say, in the West because of the attire of, that they were wearing. Obviously, they were wearing, you know, period pieces like late 1800s, early 1900s. But um, it, it was just the hat that the guy was wearing. It looked like, the, I mean, each of them looked like they were wearing more like cowboy hats, most likely. Um, or at least something of that, um, of that shape of hat. You know, I wasn't a Pandora, I wasn't a farmer's hat, you know, like the straw hat. It wasn't any of that stuff. So, um, that's what it was. And this movie had to be made, like, in, like, like, the late 90s. Because when I saw it. It was like the year 99, so it must have been made within that year or the or previous year 98. So I don't know. Um, so it was like it had to be a late 90s film or, or something. I don't know, but it, it did. It was made in the 90s, most likely. Um, so in. In this movie, like I said, it, it most likely seems to take place during the late 1800s, possibly the early 1900s. I just know it was post-Civil War. Um, there was a gentleman, he obviously owned the farm, and he was a white man. And he had like his long coat, like the cowboy coats, and he's uh, on like the ranch. So he's on the ranch and he's looks he's coming out of like the barn area and he's looking around and there's a young uh, colored boy a young you know I don't like saying black but, but you guys know what I mean so the little boy you know he's playing around like he's at the fence and he's like playing with the brushes that are most likely used to brush the horses so he's like playing with them and the the gentleman goes up to the little boy um, I don't know the little boy's name he called him and then the little boy turned to him and he goes yes sir you know yes sir you know responding I guess sir what do you need and the guy goes the man goes did you do whatever you were supposed to he was supposed to do something and the little boy goes no and um frustrated the the owner says, well, next time when I tell you to do something, you better do it. You need to do it. You know, the little boy goes, yes, sir. And he goes, go on now. You know, and the little boy runs off to do whatever he needs to do. Um, later on, he talks to his wife and he kind of starts to regret and feel a little bit guilty of how he, um, he held the situation, how he handled it. He didn't like that. Um, he, you know, didn't want that family because obviously that family lived on the land and they were working on the land he didn't want that family to think that he was racist like possibly the his family was he didn't want that he wanted to break away from that he wanted to go yes you do work for me yes I am a white man and you are a colored you know you are a black man but it shouldn't matter we are both equals you know I'm your boss yes but that doesn't mean I can't treat you like a human being I can't treat you as an equal so, um, so the wife has an idea and says, you know, how about this? You know, how about we invite them to dinner? You know, let's get to know them. They can get to know us. They can be a little more comfortable working with us, you know, instead of thinking that if they do something wrong, they'll get punished, you know, things like that. Let's, you know, let's break away from that. Let's show them. Let's do, let's do just that. Let's show them that we can be friends. We're good people. Just because we work together doesn't mean we can't you know, be civilized, you know, and the, um, the husband's like going, yeah, I don't, I don't see why not, I think that's a great idea, 
So they invite the family in and everything's going well. At first, yeah, I mean, at first the, the family's a little bit, you know, tensed up. They're a little bit, you know, guarded and so forth because they don't know. But as the dinner continues... They start to loosen up. They start to calm down. They start to get to know each other. You know, everything seems fine. Um, the little boy is with their little boys. There was a ton of little boys. Like, I don't know if if they were sons, if they were adopted, who, who, whatever. It was a lot of boys, possibly seven, eight boys. And they had one room and they had beds across, <laughs> across from each other, like in a line on both sides. And uh, the little, you know, boys will be boys. The boys seem to be having fun. They're talking to the kid. They're playing with them. The little boy's playing with them. You know, everything seems to be going well. Then um, they start to have a pillow fight. And, again, they're having fun. They're laughing. They're hitting each other. They're going, yeah, you know, having fun. And uh, the... Uh, the little boy, the colored boy, uh, you know, as he's playing around, he's he's jump, he's playing around, he's having fun. He happens to jump on a bed. He jumps on a bed, and it just so happens to belong to one of the boys. And one of the boys saw that and didn't seem to like that. And he goes, "Hey, that's my bed." And the little boy thinking that he was playing when he goes to go get him, to go after him, he jumps out of the bed and he's running around and he's hitting the other boys with the pillow and everyone's laughing. No one's, you know, no one seems to be noticing what's taking place or what's about to take place. As this is happening upstairs, downstairs, they can hear the ruckus, they can hear the jumping and pouncing and they look at each other and are like, well, what is going on? So... They start to go upstairs to see what the ruckus was. And um, as they're going up, the boy that... The, the boy whose bed it belongs to, or, or I don't know. The bed that belongs to the boy uh, starts to... Uh, kind of starts to hit him with the balloon really hard. Aggressively. Pow, pow. To a point where the boy is on, up against the bed and, you know, basically being hit. Right when both of the parents open the door, they then are catch the boy being punched. So the son of the farmer punches the boy. And everyone is like completely like shocked, like going like, what the heck just happened? How did this happen? Of course, both parents, you know, are shocked. And are, of course, like, what the hell is going on? What just happened? Why did you punch this? You know, that's what their reaction is. And you can see that the farmer's face is just like, great. Now this family is going to think we're racist when we're not. All because one of my sons or one of my boys... Decided to beat up this poor boy when we don't know what happened. You can see both sides of the face like, okay, now that wall is back up. And the the little boy turns to them like, obviously, like, oh, crap, oh, crap. We're, we're caught. And you see he has a bloody nose. So I don't know what happened next I, I, uh, because the channel was changed. Um, so I never saw what happened after that. Um, I don't know what the movie was called. I just remember those parts and those scenes. And obviously I would like to know what that movie is so I can see the rest of it because... I mean, first up, boys will be boys. But I mean, come on, that boy obviously knew right, right from wrong. You know, and obviously that little boy meant no harm. They're having fun. You know, you got beds, you're in the room, you're jumping on the bed. What's the problem? It, he did no harm. He could have just said, hey, don't jump on my bed no more. Or, hey, get off the bed, we can't be jumping. I don't know. But, yeah, that's the movie. So, if you guys happen to know the name of that movie, 
let me know because I would like to know what it is. I would like to watch it again. And, um, excuse me. I don't think it was Little Men. I really don't think so because it just didn't seem like it was. Like maybe it was Little Men, but then again, the Little Men I grew up with didn't take place during that or that period of time. I don't know. But I... I have a strict feeling it wasn't it. If it was, cool, great. Uh, let me know the name of the episode or the movie. But I don't think it was. So if y'all happen to know what the movie is, leave a comment down below with the name and uh, let me know. It'll be uh, greatly appreciated, okay? 